broke again. Hopefully it'll stay. Hope you're all doing good. I'm out in the back here. The sun just came out from out the clouds. It's uh, a beautiful day now. Uh, it was pretty muggy and ugly looking, but the uh, uh, sun came out as soon as I started the uh, Promac 1010, right? And uh, the sun just shined. It, I started and the sun just shined. I just literally broke this my stand my tripod here so uh bear with me that's why you're leaning <laughs> go figure huh uh well i do have the bucking special out here today so we're gonna do some swinging but i'm gonna have some minor difficulties here technical di difficulties with the stand <laughs> so i gotta hang on to it <laughs> all right folks we got uh some trees to clean up here uh, I got some pines out back here as you can see in the base here. It is ugly got some dead limbs need to clean up So I feel like swinging today. I'm gonna swing the bucking special and uh, uh, Run the old Pro Mac 1010 this 1010 the Pro Max as you all know the Pro Max series are my favorite all the Pro Max I Don't know why but they're my favorite by far and I'm a little obsessed with it <laughs> but uh but yes yeah, so this is my go-to saw this is what I take with me on my jobs uh, and all my tree jobs it's my main saw I love it and uh, between that and my husky uh, I, I run them all the time they're my they're my, they're my babies <laughs> so I'm going to fix well, I can't fix it out here, but I'm going to rig up my tripod the best I can so you all get some uh, footage of cleaning up that tree. So, bear with me. I got uh, some difficulties here. All right, folks. I think you'll be all right. I'm going to clean up this tree here. Uh, I'm going to get the Pro Mac running here. It should start up. I haven't got it warmed up yet quite warmed up I started a little while ago but uh, we'll get warmed up again it should fire on the first pull believe it or not this saw is all stock I have not done anything special to it um, uh, not yet anyway um, but I might just keep it as is it's still running off the points it still has all the original stuff on it it's 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 phenomenal I, it's just I don't know something about it it's uh it's a good saw so let's get to work shall we let's do it
Well, I'm gonna stand back and see what she looks like, huh? Probably take a couple more off on the other side and a little bit on the back. But yeah, not too bad. It'll clean up real nice. Should grow pretty healthy. The top is really healthy. Should be alright. Get something off of this one here too. Actually, this one don't look too good. Might have to take that one down. Oh darn. <laughs> yep. Yeah, that salt that salt runs beautiful. Beautiful. Yep. I it's not it's a manual oiler, so I do have a uh, automatic oiler that I want to put into it. So it'll take a little bit of work, but I'm gonna put one in there. Yep. <laughs> Let's do some swinging. Uh, that was a beautiful fall. Landed right where I wanted it, right between the two trees here. Yep, that thing was, it's all dead as you can see. Dead pine. So, we're gonna uh, do some lemon and buck it up, right? Yeah. Alright, let's do it. I think you'll stay. That tripod is just broke again. Hopefully it'll stay.
walking back here, right? So I got a lot of trees back here. You know, a few, mostly pine trees. Um, I think they're they're wild trees, but they're uh, not in a good area. They don't get a lot of sunlight, so a lot of them dying. See, you got some behind me. They're dying. Yeah, those are dying. But a lot of them, I could just clear out a couple. A lot of them are okay. I can, I, I, I'm all, they'll grow. They'll, they'll revive themselves, you know. Uh, just the way nature is. It just does that sometimes. But, I found one back here. And I just happened to look through the trees after I was getting done cutting up there. Well, I found one back here in the very back. In the very, very back. Yep. You see that, folks? We got a leaner. And it's going back to the far back neighbor's property there. Uh, their line of trees. Um, yeah, and then I got another one here. This one I should be able to climb. But it's, it's seen better days. <laughs> Uh, but this one, I don't have a whole lot of room to take the whole tree down, but it is next to a, a good one right here. Uh, I be I should be able to take that. Yeah, there's a couple back ones here. I put a tagline on there, uh, and uh, I'll I'll be able to climb that pretty safely. There's just a lot of limbs on it. See all them limbs? So it takes a little bit to clear all those out to get up, shimmy up to the top. And that top is just before the property line, the tree line there. So I should be able to take off the top and chunk it on the way down. And uh, safely with the tag line back there so it'll hold. But yeah. Got ourselves a little project here, huh? I'm gonna take a look over this way. Oh, she's a leaner. We got a leaner. So, that's this is the tree here, and it goes right up to the property line. Yeah, it's not really dead. I had, the ground is soft and rotten, but the base out. That's a lot of these trees. We have rabbits back here too. that are doing, taking out a lot of my pine trees. So, yeah. Well, folks. We'll get back at it. We'll do a little bit more cutting and uh, call it a day. It's getting kind of late. And I'm hungry. Alright, folks. See you back at the tree. Oh, camera's over here. <laughs> Alright, folks. I'll be back. Yeah. Thanks.